So this is a hole in, this happens to be in a pair of tights, but it could equally well be in a sock, um, where the hole is in the toe, um, but if we did a back stitch, we'd end up with a solid seam, which could be uncomfortable. So this is just a very simple stitch. It's officially called a whip stitch, um, which makes it sound posh, but it's just stitching over and over and over again. I'm going to use a, a brightly coloured thread here, just so that you can see what I'm doing. I'm going to get rid of that little annoying bit there. So I've secured my thread just beyond the hole. And then all I'm going to do is work my way along the hole in the tights or socks, catching the thread, sorry, the, the fabric, um, where it's still secure. And I'm not pulling it hugely tight. Uh, I'm just pulling it together. Can you see I'm not yanking the thread at all? And I'm going quite wide. And it's important if I'm going wide that I leave the thread fairly loose. And as we said about mending, it's not about beauty, it's about function. It will be embarrassing if you go into somebody's house and take your socks off, but at least you haven't got your toes sticking out. So I'll see you mend. If you've done it in the same colour, then that won't be so obvious. So go all the way to the end. Uh, that's taken, what, a minute? And it may seem silly to mend tights like this, but I mean, they cost quite a lot of money and there's absolutely nothing wrong with the rest of it. And no one can see this when I've got my shoes on. So there we are, that's it. So I do tight at either end, but it's loose in between. And you can see it looks a mess. There's no, no beauty, that. But now I'm gonna put my hand into the tight and hopefully, that will work. Yep, there. So now I'm stretching it out on itself and it's held the pieces together, but it's not too lumpy. You know, that's wearable. I could put, do with putting an extra stitch there, but that's okay, it's mended. <laughs> 